one, two, three. I'm testing in one, two, three, one, two, three. I'm testing this Texas Instruments program recorder. One, two, three, one, two, three. I don't know how old it is. One, two, three, one, two, three. The microphone, the condenser microphone is not working. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. I got to go, got to go, got to go. to um, tell you about this here Texas um, Instruments Program Recorder. Um, I had just got back and had a ton of things that I was doing at one time when I um, tried to perform this thing. I just pushed the counter and it works and um, I've had totally cleaned and lubed this here um, Texas Instrument Program recorder that I bought from the disabled veterans um, thrift store here in Amarillo on 6th Street. They had quite a bit of few things, you know, stuck and dirty and filthy. This um, recorder was filthy dirty um, to the point where I could not even record. So, I mean, I was really frustrated because I couldn't get the doggone thing to do what I wanted it to do. So, I mean, I had to take time and fix it, basically, and I was pissed. I paid $5 for it, and now, I'm, now it's coming in clear. It plays music well. I did the test with SafePod music. Um, also, um, I could use this music to um, test out my um, tape players. I have fair use of using it um, within reason. And um, this is a very nice um, beige or bone color um, tape recorder. I like this color, and I like um, silver tape recorders, too. I've seen the Texas Instrument Program recorders on eBay. It is really, and, I've, and, I, and I, they go for about 20 bucks. So I got quite a deal here. And um, they can even be more than $20, actually. Things are getting pretty high. It, it, things are going up and up and up on eBay, and the, the quality of things are going down, 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 down. There's something wrong with that picture. So now what I basically do is try to find my stuff at my local um, thrift stores. And um, they had quite a bit of stuff at the veterans' um, uh, store, and uh, tucked under stuff in, in places where you wouldn't believe. I had to... Um, I, I could have missed this thing. It was down un underneath something, and I pulled it out. This also was a Tasha Bisha boom box. I've had enough of boom boxes. I, and um, so um, I, I, I've gotten back to, um, I found one more um, um, uh, shoe box, and I'm glad about that because I enjoy shoe boxes. And because you can do more with them, what I really want is a, big size reel to reel. That is what I'm hoping on maybe in a month and a half or two months from now. Sometime in July probably. I probably be I might be able to come through with that. that that's a big might because they're so doggone expensive up at eBay. 
um, you know, and then I, I'm, I'm afraid to um, even buy one at eBay because in, in, in fear that it might be, I pay all this money and it might turn around and be a dud. So now I've gotten so like, you know, I'm like leery of eBay, like, you know, anything I, that I buy is like, you know, God, do I have to gut it and build from the start, um, build from, from the ground up? And if, that, if, that, if that's the way I've got to buy stuff, I'd rather not buy from them. And so I will, you know, in my endeavors here, I will travel, you know, and, and, and look at thrift stores for my stuff. Every now and then I might get something from eBay if it's guaranteed. And um, um, these people who say, oh, it, the wheels turned but um, and some noise came out, uh, here, take it anyway. What kind of mess is that? <laughs> so so I, I've had enough of these kind of people. So this was my test, and this is a, a hands, very handsome um, tape recorder that I got for five bucks. No, no shipping handle fees, no crap, no bull, just five bucks on the counter, out the door. <laughs>